Holy shit. It's almost fucking Christmas, boys. Okay, so now you wanna make love to me. Girl, if you don't get the fuck from me. I know you thought we had something special, but you don't mean nothing to me. Girl, I'm sorry you not the one for me. Yo guys, what is up? It is James here in Winter Tusk in the snowbounds of Wiz. Today, doing an update video, talking about some things that are going to be going down really, really soon here, as well as the bring up of a new character, uh, the legendary Ice, the Ice Broken. The man himself is being brought up right now, being leveled with your boy Dylan and William. If you guys have seen my, uh, th my 3v3 video with Jay, then you guys know who William is. And if you guys saw my crowns, um, crown giveaway video with Dylan or my Chibi Chu Magus uh, tourney with Dylan, then you know who he is. But basically, a lot is going down right now. Um, I want to wish you guys a happy holidays. If you don't have any holidays that you are celebrating um, soon or at all, then I hope you guys have a fantastic uh, month or the rest of your month. But the holidays and Christmas for me is right around the corner and they're coming up super fast. New things are going to be happening on the channel very, very soon. And today I want to talk about those things with you guys. So first and foremost, I want to talk about this new character. So I am bringing up a legendary ice, the ice level 66. Probably I might go to 68 for mammoth, but I mean, it's not really that big of a deal. Um, since it, it's ice and ice uses, they mostly use uh, overtimes anyway. So I don't really know if I want to get mammoth, but if it's something that I think would prove good for the ice meta uh, at legendary, then I will go for it. But um, as far as streaming, because I usually stream when um, when I do level a character, I will probably not be streaming this time around. Maybe when I get to Celestia and uh, Winter Tusk, because as soon as Christmas comes around, that is when I'm going to be starting on my new series coming to the channel, which has something to do with Smash Bros. I'll talk about that in a little bit, but this character is going to level 60 and I will be doing some PvP videos on him probably sometime during 2017, so that will be like a new surprise to the channel. Um, I have done Legendary Ice before, but I deleted the character and brought back my Legendary Life, which I don't, st I, I still don't use. Um, but I think the change was good because my life is is really really good and he's outfitted for every situation so if i want to ever do a 4v4 2v2 or 3v3 or even lore master spam with with a uh, balance mastery and ranked then i can do that with my life so he's outfitted for all situations but the one school that i am missing is ice so sometime during 2017 i'll say is when you guys will see the first ice legendary pvp but i'm definitely hype about that because the first time around when i was doing some legendary ice uh, it wasn't really the best. I didn't know how to go about it, but seeing how I have every school legendary except for ice, I'm pretty sure I can do ice as well. So uh, I will be bringing uh, the ice broken up uh, in leveling and crafting Winter Moon on him and the whole nine yards. So that will be a thing. So the second thing here that I want to talk about is the um, return of hosted tournaments on Wiz. Now, me and Jay were talking with each other the other day in DMs, and he goes, when I return from vacation, and for those of you that don't know, Jay is currently on vacation. Right now, he is, I think, in Vegas, and sometime in a couple of days here, he might be going to Hawaii, So, or he might be in Hawaii already. I'm not sure, but uh, yeah, Jay's, Jay's living that lavish vacation right now, so Jay, if you're watching this video, shout out to you, man. Um, I see you, fam, but... We were talking about bringing back um, the hosted tournaments. And for those of you that remember, me and Jay used to host, sometime around last summer, uh, Legendary and Max tournaments. And we would only give a prize to the Grand Finals winner. Well, this time around, if we do end up bringing them back, which, we'll, which most likely we will, um, top three will qualify for prizes. Now, I can't tell you how 
you know, big or static the prizes will be, but I can tell you they're going to be really, really good, and you're definitely going to want to compete if you have the free time, so um, stay tuned to see if we do bring those back. All right, so other than that, I do want to talk about this new series on my channel that most of you should know about, but in case you didn't watch my last uh, Madam Myth PvP video, which popped a couple of days ago, um, I will be starting a new series on the channel sometime around Christmas, and that series is Super Smash Brothers for Wii U, uh, for Glory. I might be playing with friends if they do come over my house and decide to play, and for Glory doubles. So um, I'm not really sure exactly how I'm going to construct this series or construct. I should have said not construct, construct. I don't know, but. Uh, I will be doing some Smash Brothers on my channel. It is going to be a staple series along with Wiz. Wiz is not going anywhere, guys. I don't want you to think that I'm leaving Wiz for Smash Bros. But Smash Bros. has a very awesome uh, fan base and community. And the game is overall very hard to not like because the character cast is very large. Um, it has a variety, like a large variety of characters. And the mechanics and the overall like gameplay of the game is just... It pretty much equates to endless fun. So, I mean, if you're into the game, then great. We have a new series on the channel for you guys to enjoy. I really do hope you guys enjoy this new series. I will be trying to, uh, you know, make it fun and entertaining to watch. And I cannot wait to start recording some Smash. Like, it's honestly just something, you know, new and exciting. And, you know, not many people uh, upload like Smash Bros for Wii U on YouTube. Like some notable people are like A Star the Third, uh, Alpha Rad, and maybe some other people that you guys may or may not watch. But there aren't that many people that upload Smash Bros for Wii U. But most of the people who do it only upload Smash Bros. So I'm not going to turn into one of those YouTubers, but I will definitely balance out Wiz with Smash Bros. And depending on how you guys like it, more videos may pop more often than some other videos but i definitely think it is the most wisest decision um as a series on the channel that isn't wiz because i feel like playing another mmo is very like selective and it's subject to many people not liking that particular mmo or not wanting to watch a series on that mmo but smash bros is a game that has been out for a long time it's had like, you know, uh, many sequels like Smash 4 or Brawl and like adults enjoy the game. People that are like well beyond the age of 50 still play the game. The game is awesome. And like the second best player in the world on that game is like 15. And like that's like he rivals a person that has won 50 Smash tournaments in a row. So, I mean, you can tell that people that are teenagers play this game and take it very seriously and play competitive and when these tournaments are streamed anywhere from like 20,000 to 50,000 people watch these tournaments for a smash bros game so you can already tell that the community is hype it's lit it's it's just amazing and the atmosphere like surrounding the game and its players in a competitive scene especially is is usually really friendly and it's heated to the point where you aren't really like like fighting or like you know saying anything nasty to, like to another person you're just hyping your favorite person on so it has that like restraint so you don't go over the point where it's like you're versing somebody in whiz right and then you're trash talking them because their pet is bad or whatever i mean that, like that does happen but it's not really common on smash bros but the community in general is is i would say less toxic and much much larger like by miles than wizards community so smash bros i think definitely is a very good choice and that series will be happening sometime around christmas as i said again so um with all of that being said i think that is going to wrap up this update video um 2017 things are going to start happening. I am getting a professional mic because this mic is honestly, it's, it's giving way. If you guys have noticed in some of my other videos, I had to manually tweak 
uh, my microphone volume because I, I mean this microphone it's pretty cheap it has decent quality as you can probably tell but because it's so cheap it I guess it, it only took like half a year for it to give out so I did order a blue Yeti microphone and that will be coming out or, or not coming out but that will be available for me to use on Christmas so I cannot wait to up my quality in videos and up the quality of my equipment so that I can put out better videos and hopefully start doing some more edits and maybe skits um, pertaining to Wizard 101. I'm not too sure about that, but overall we have a new character on the come up, which is Legendary Ice. Uh, we might be bringing back tournaments. Um, I might be streaming some leveling on my ice after Christmas in between doing Smash and PvP on Wiz. Uh, and then uh, Smash Bros as a series will be coming to my channel. So I do implore you to give that a chance because I think it is going to be really good for the channel and I hope you guys will enjoy the content that I put out on Smash. So with all that being said, this is going to be James giving you all the sign out. I hope you guys had a fantastic day and continue to have a fantastic day or fantastic holidays. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.